Feeling froggy? Yeah. Hey, hey, y'all. Hi, everyone. Well, we are back <laughs> with another episode of Show Me Sherry Stitch Fix Edition. <laughs> is it Show Me Sherry or is it Show Me Scooby? This should be Scooby. <laughs> Both. Sherry show and me, Scooby. Show me Sherry, Scooby. Show me Sherry and Scooby. Show me Scooby and Sherry. Okay. Show me something. <laughs> show me something. All right. Yes, we have our duo stitch fix. Now, I want to say, well, first of all, thank you for being here with us. Oh, yes, thank you. <laughs> we really appreciate it very much. If you're new here, drop down below and let us know where you're watching from so that we can welcome you personally, or I can welcome you personally. Dwayne doesn't. Generally read the you, comments. I welcome you too. She, <laughs> I usually don't read the comments, but I welcome everybody. Thank you for stopping by. Yes, thank you. And hope you revisit again. Yes. <laughs> As a matter of fact, we could use y'all's help. We have a goal. Or I set a goal, but he's he's with me. You're with me, right? Yes, I'm with you. We want... <laughs> I we... thought I was with you. <laughs> I mean... I have set a personal goal for the for the channel or for for the channel. Um, I would like to see it hit a thousand subscribers by the end of the year. I know that's a tall order. I think that I think you will do it. I can't do it without y'all's help. There's a lot of good people out there that are willing to help you out. I know they are. Well, I, um, my analytics show that over 50% of my watchers are not subscribed. So I would just ask right now for a favor and please subscribe. It doesn't cost anything and it would be amazing to hit that goal by the end of this year, December yeah, 31st. It would greatly help you out to re reach that goal. Yes. So I would love it. I would love it. So if you all haven't subscribed yet, just hit that button for me. I really appreciate it. Okay, so enough about that. Okay, one of the things, one of the things that I really like about Silver Swag, opening Silver Swag, we like the box. We like activities, we like the variety, okay? But one of the things that I really like about opening that box is they have those convo cards that Show Me Sherry really likes. It gets us talking and usually that will lead to a path of, oh, this is a story. Hey, I got something to tell you. So. I miss those cards when we don't have our silver swag. So y'all- wait, wait a minute. What? Do you know what I like about the silver swag? Snacks. Scooby snacks. Yeah. Everybody knows what you like about silver swag. So we're gonna have a combo, huh? <laughs> so I found where you could get combo cards. <laughs> Lots of them. Lots of them. So I thought whenever we do a video together, I will pull two and he will pull two. Let me ask you something. Where did you get these combo cards? At the getting place. Where is the getting place? Where you get everything? Yeah. Does it start with an A? Yeah. <laughs> and Amazon. The hmm. Maybe somebody else would like to have those too. Well, okay. So I wasn't going to say, but since he opened that door, these are just the original convo cards. Okay. And these are like so high rated. So I will drop that link below. But... When I got to researching this, they have combo cards for different subjects. So for our Christmas, um, we have a, you know, our, our family, our whole family gets together for Christmas and um, they have a convo card pack for family gatherings. So I'll drop that link below too, because I, got, I picked those up for our Christmas. Okay, so we're gonna pull two cards each. And we're gonna ask each other the question. And I guess we could answer too if we want. What if we don't like the card? Do we get to put it back and get another one? No, no. Are we crooked? I feel like we're crooked. I'm not crooked. You don't think? Mm. All right. All right, so. You might be. <laughs> oh, I thought it had a hinge. You broke the lid. No, it doesn't have a you hinge. You broke the hinge. No, I didn't. All right, I'm pulling a card. Now you pull the next card. Anywhere? Don't, don't, no, 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 not anywhere. It has to be in the front that way. Oh, wait a minute. That might be a direction. That is direction. See? Okay. Now, pull that one. Then I'll pull one. You pull one, and that's it. I can't get a hold of it. I think I'm pulling two. 
Well, well you can't, you're not allowed to pull two. I, I got one. No, you don't. Yeah, I do. Yeah, you do. <laughs> okay, now you I pull one. I know what I'm doing. All right, now we're gonna take turns. I'm gonna put the lid back on for now. Now, when we're done, it'll go in the back. I hope this is a good or in idea. the front. All right, I'll start, ladies first. What do you love about your hometown? What do I love about my hometown? Hmm, I know it real well. I know it like the back of my hand. Like I can say, I don't get lost in my hometown. That's what you love about your hometown? Yeah. Okay. That I don't, I don't get lost. I can go anywhere in town and know, know how to get there and know how to get out of there. Maybe we should only pull one card <laughs> instead of two. Why? Because I thought we'd both ask, I, blah, blah, I thought we'd both answer the question. You can answer it too. But that's four. That would be a long video, wouldn't it? I don't know. Maybe we should just do two. Okay. What I love about my hometown. Is this considered my hometown? I don't know. Is it? I've You're... moved a lot. But I've been here since I was 14. So I guess we can I'd say it has became your hometown, yes. Okay. Okay. So what do I love about I was born here. my hometown? That I met my husband. Well, another thing that I like is I met my wife, but... Okay, next question. My turn? Yes. Okay. Where would you... Oh, this is down your alley. <laughs> Good. Where would you most like to travel? <laughs> Since you're the travel bug. Anywhere. But where most? Would you like travel the most? I don't have one answer to that question. Right. Um, I would... I have a variety. What's the most? Where would be the first place you would like to travel to? If you could travel anywhere. If money wasn't an object? Yeah. I can easily answer that for I myself. know you can, and it's, I know what it is. I'm gonna just blanket it. I'm gonna blanket my answer with Europe. So I don't- She's gonna give you a female answer <laughs> because she can't make a decision. He doesn't make decisions either very well. I know this answer. I know, but you also want to see a few other places in Europe too. Mm -hmm. Not just the Alps. We both want to see the Alps. Yeah, that would be mine, would be the Swiss Alps. Yes. Well, they're also in Germany and France, too, aren't they? Yes, but that mountain range in general. Yes. Well, I would like to see that also. Very, very, very much. But I would also like to see Italy. I would also like to see the Eiffel Tower and eat a croissant fresh. Yes, I know that's not on plan. But we're talking vacation. In an ideal world, huh? Yeah, but here in the United States, there's a lot of places I would really like to see. I would, Such as? I want to see the national parks out west. You know, I really do. I want to see all those. Um, I want to see the Florida Keys. I think that would be neat. I would like to see Savannah, Georgia and Charleston, South Carolina. I would like to see um, New England states in the fall. Um, I'd like to see Waco because I was supposed to go for my 50th um, birthday and someone broke their ankle. So <laughs> who was the someone? Yeah, I think everybody knows who the someone is. <laughs> um, yeah, so I would, there's a lot of places I would like to see. And those are just the things that I know about. There's probably things out there that I don't know about that I would like to see. What I would not like to see might be easier. I don't want to see big urban concrete cities. I'm not big on cities. No, I, I don't like big crowds. Mm -mm. I don't like lots of population. I can say I like just enjoying God's country. Yes. So what's your answer? Swiss Alps. Oh, yeah. That's what I would most like to wear the most. Like well, to his travel. answer was five seconds. My answer was five minutes. And Alaska. Oh, see, me too. Okay. How will our culture change in the next 100 years? <laughs> How will... I won't care. <laughs> the next 100 years, I'm going to say, 
I don't think I'm going to have to worry about it. I'm going to say my answer to that is, um, I think in a hundred years from now, there will be a lot of, I'm trying to figure out how to say this. It's kind of scary to think about. It is. Um, I think that it will be, everything will be more automated and people won't be leaving their homes. I think there won't be a lot of human interaction in a hundred years. I it's think gonna, technology, it's going to be all technology. It's going to be like the Jetsons. When you're down, what makes you feel better? You. Oh, really? Mm, you have a way to, when you're not grumpy and you're actually nice. I'm never grumpy. <laughs> I'm always nice. I'm the nicest guy I know. I keep telling her that. Yeah, he's told me that for years. And I say, he doesn't know that many guys. Yeah, I do. No, I'm just I'm kidding. the nicest guy I know. Um, you actually, yeah. Really? Yeah. Because it, not very many people can turn my mood around and you seem to be able to do that. Okay. What besides me might make you feel better? Um, Shelby, she can do that too. Sometimes. Do they know who Shelby is? I think so. Your, her daughter? Our daughter. Her daughter, yes. Um, and if I'm going to be honest, and I said I would always be honest, Ben and Jerry has also always had a hand in making me feel better. <laughs> I figure it was some food related yeah, item. Yeah, yeah, unfortunately. Ice cream. Yes. But that is a habit that I am trying to break because that's what it is, y'all. It's a habit. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. How about you? What makes you feel better? Um, I try not to get down. I'm not gonna say I know it's hard at times. I see you smirking, <laughs> <laughs> but I really try not to get down. But when I'm feeling down, you can make me feel better. You're stealing my answer. No, you can. And just getting away, just being able to pull myself away from everything and take time for myself. Travel. Not necessarily always travel. Just being able to unplug. It's always travel in my book. Well, that helps. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Well, I can say probably if I travel to the Swiss Alps, I'm going to say it would really do it. <laughs> well, let me know if you like the combo cards. We'll try it a few more times, but uh, we'll see how that goes. Okay. Stitch fix. Stitch fix. Five pieces. Three days to try it on. $20 styling fee. Anything that you decide to keep, uh, that $20 will be applied to your purchase. You work with a personal stylist. In a perfect world, they get to know your style as you go along and your fixes become better and better. If you keep all five, you get a 25% off discount. That's always nice. If we don't keep all five, we generally will only keep one item. Maybe two, but never three or four. <laughs> it just doesn't make stitch fix. It doesn't make sense. It's not stitch fix math. It doesn't add up. It's like common core math, right? No. <laughs> like the new math the kids are doing in school? I don't think I could ever figure out common core math. Uh, it's weird. It okay, weird. so... It's pretty um, bad to say whenever you have a child in school nowadays and people our age can't even help them with simple math. Yeah. Because we don't understand common core math. Yet we can get to the answer. We can get to the answer, yeah. But, but not, not their way. Mm -hmm. Not the way they need to show it on paper. No. Anything you don't want to keep, you just put in the self-addressed, not self-addressed, you, <laughs> any, anything you decide you don't want to keep in the box, they have included a mailer that's already postage paid, labeled, um, that you put in the mailer. You put your, my goodness, Sherry, you put the items you don't want in the mailer, seal it up and take it to the post office. <laughs> Easy, simple. Don't know why I'm struggling to talk about that. So. Let's see what we got. Your turn. I did my surgery. I have two bundles, y'all. Two. Two bundles? Two. Two bundles. How did you rate? You get two. I don't know, but I got two. Mailer I was talking about. Oh. I got one bundle. All right. So you give me the paperwork. Don't mix them up. No, I won't. 
Yours is a different color green. Is it? Yeah. Mine's light. Yours is dark green. Oh, nice. Oh, his oh, bundle tour. All right, let's show our bundles. I have two. There's one bundle. I like the colors already. Ooh. There's another bundle. Ooh, I see some color. Oh, I think I see. Oh, metallic. Okay, I like that. I hope it fits. You have Bailey. Bailey watched last time. Hi, Bailey. Hi, Bailey. If you're watching. You did great last Thank time. Thank you. <laughs> Do you want to read yours? I will say I like the colors that Bailey picked out for me. I am liking the colors. She has got your style down quick. I think she's getting getting my style as if she hasn't already gotten it, yes. Yeah. She's getting, you know, I'm liking what I say. Likey, likey. Are you going to read it or no? Uh, you'll have to read it because I can't. I don't have my glasses either. Okay. Happy fix day, Dwayne. Bailey here again. I am beyond thrilled to hear you enjoyed your last box. He really did, Bailey. Mm -hmm. I made sure to keep your budget at top of mind Good. when selecting the items for today's fix. I was taking a look at your previous fixes and noticed we haven't sent a pair of chinos yet. So, chinos? I knew that was coming. <laughs> it's like khakis. Oh, I know what Cheetos are. <laughs> I like Cheetos. No. Uh, so I thought the flag and anthem pants would be fun to try. These will be perfect for fall and winter. Let me know how you like the fit and style. If these are a no-go, I will make sure to avoid similar pieces moving forward. She really listens to you. Wear I'm these glad somebody does. <laughs> hey. I know somebody that doesn't always hey. listen to me. <laughs> that's not... Oh. Sometimes. But I'm sure that's a two-way street. I will not even go there. <laughs> I'm sure you think that I don't listen to you sometimes. I know you don't. I don't think it. Okay, wear these pants with the retro fit hoodie and pop on a pair of sneakers or chuckas for date night with Sherry. What's chuckas? I knew yeah. that was coming. They're we talking talked about this. They're talking in terms that I don't know. We talked about chuckas last time I showed you a picture. They're like a leather, kind of like a topsider, but in a but in a boot. They're leather. Oh, okay. Like a they're really nice looking. I like my hey dudes. Well, they're kind of like your leather hey dudes, except in a boot. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Leather boot, leather hey dude boots. <laughs> Since you <laughs> left. Oh my. Are you going to chuck of this part of the video? Maybe. <laughs> Since you love hoodies, I also added in the hoodie from Hawker Rye for you to wear with the jeans you kept last time. You kept a pair of Hawker Wright jeans yes, and, and I love like them. them. Matter of yes. fact, I've got them on right now. Oh, wow. And I love the the wash of them. They're so comfortable. Stretch and they got, they're just nice. They're yes. Always, I like the fit. Because I like it's the a good feel. quality. Yes. Well, I hope you enjoy. Uh, I do enjoy. <laughs> Cheers, Bailey. P.S. You and Sherry made my day the last unboxing video. Loved it. <laughs> I'm so glad. All right. Yeah, yes. So, my note. And I got Leslie again. I'm sorry, Melissa. I didn't mean to steal her. I was just <laughs> wanting to share. Okay, happy fix sticks. Happy fix sticks. All fiddlesticks. All fiddlesticks. Happy fix day, Sherry. With you looking for wow pieces to add to your wardrobe, the sweater you selected from the fix preview, plus the four other pieces I added in are going to give you just that. The blouses by Sanctuary and Daniel Rain both have gorgeous patterns that just have fall written all over them. She is a speaking my language. Pair these with your jeans to dress them up a bit for an evening out. They will also go nicely with black slash navy pants as well. I'm keeping my eye on the lookout for both colors to send you for that closet refresh. And for those chilly days and evenings in Missouri, the knit top by Market and Spruce plus the sweaters by Stitches and Stripes and Sophie Rue We'll give you pops of bold colors and on-trend patterns. Have fun trying everything on. XO Leslie. I'm we, really excited. We have had some chilly nights already. Yeah. Yeah. Not right. today. Today was in the 80s. I was going to say, we had one night, what, last week? It got down to... In the 20s. 20s. Yeah. yeah. That's a little, a little early for that. He brought in my plumerias the night before, thank God, because he saved them. Yeah, they were going to die. Please. Okay. Oh, I thought this was mine, and I'm like, oh, I so beat you, but I didn't. What? 
Bailey's got yours down like cheap, cheap. What's cheap, cheap? 160. Ooh, that is cheap, cheap. Yeah. For that many items. Mm -hmm. Mine's 245, but that's not bad. Ooh. Because there's one thing in here for $99. Really? Yeah, the most expensive thing in your box is $69.50, and that's the pants. Wow. Okay, let's go. Girls first. Let's do you first. Your bundle's already open. Well, how come you didn't open yours? Okay, I'll go first. Ladies first. It's hot in here. Do you feel hot? It's kind of warm. Okay, first is a blouse. Oh, this is the sanctuary. Sanc sanctuary. Sanctuary blouse. Thank she you, was Sherry. talking about. Yeah. All right. So it's a ditzy floral pattern. A ditzy floral? Yes, that's what it's called. No, it's not stupid. It's, it's kind small. Of ditzy? ditzy means small. Not in my vocabulary. Yes, it does because people call people ditzy because they're small minded. Ditzy means small. Itsy. That's itsy. Itsy bitsy spider. It's small. Itsy. Well, ditzy. Not ditzy. Ditzy means kind of simple. <laughs> ditzy floral is like a. Never mind. <laughs> All right. So the colors are really pretty. It does scream fall. Um, it's very sheer, so I would have to wear something under it. It has blouse and sleeves and looks like some rufflage. Rufflage? Rufflage right there. Um, elastic band around the wrist. And some pleating right here in the front. And that pleating is also in the back. That is the back, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay. The it, it is see-through. Yeah. The split neck goes pretty low, so hopefully it's not too, too low. All right, but I'm excited to try that one on. This is the Sanctuary Pin Tuck Blouse Black, size large for $99. This is the most expensive in the in the in the fix. Okay, your turn. My turn. Yep. Well, I'm gonna get what's on top. Start with what's top. Ooh, I, I like love it. the color of this shirt. I do too. I like the material on it. Who's that by? I don't know, but I'm not. I'm looking. Anyway. Okay, that's nice. That is nice. You know what? I like. I like the color. I guess that I like is the, the color feel. of the. Uh, that is our local high school colors that we both graduated from. Aren't free, they? free nature. He's ignoring me. What? Those are the colors of our. High school. Yeah, but not this muted. Oh, okay. Free nature, long sleeve washed flannel. That's why it looks like that. It's got that washed look. Uh huh. Navy. Oh, it's only $44. I like that. That's really, I mean, I'm thinking, they're higher than that at Kohl's, y'all. I'm thinking that's a keeper. That's nice. That's really nice. Yeah. Bailey. You did a good you're job really with this good. one. I, love I, don't, I don't think he's going to stop stitch fixes as long as you're his stylist. I, I love that shirt. Yeah. I, I do. I, that's my style. Okay. Did I say what? Yeah, $44. All right. Up next, Sophie Rue by Sophie Rue. Sophie who? Sophie Rue. I never heard of Sophie Rue. Sophie Rue Carmidi Diagonal Color Block Sweater, burnt orange, size large, for just $48. All right. I got to see what this looks like. Oh, it is color blocked. It's soft. It is soft. I really like it. It feels pretty heavy. Yes. You know. I like it a lot. The only problem I see with this, it's not my color on top. It's going to wash me out. That's the only, otherwise, I liked. If it was this color burnt orange on top, it would have been probably a keeper. So what colors do you like? Well, all, all of the viewers out there are teaching me what my colors are and aren't. And everybody says creams and beiges are a no-go for me. And every time I get the same uh, feedback back, and you have said that before. I tend to agree with them. Yeah, so if I have this color on top, it's not going to work. Yeah, this color might have been better on top, see? Well, that's a pastel, so I don't know if a pastel works on me. Mm, I don't think it looks too bad. But this looks better, right? I don't know. 
I guess I can't tell. The, that does kind of wash you out mm -hmm. a little bit more, yeah. Yeah. But it goes with anything, that color does. Not me. <laughs> it goes with anything but me. All right, and the sweater is 50 rayon, 30 poly, and 20 nylon. I never did see what mine was. It's probably cotton, 100% cotton. Did you say? I didn't see. No. Oh. I know it's got to have a tag here somewhere. Yeah, right there. 100% cotton. 100% cotton. His I, favorite materials. I love natural fibers. Natural fibers, yes. All right, you're next. Oh, I'm up. Your turn, darling. All right. What do we got here? Another Dwayne shirt. Yes. And it's nice That's and a... like worn out. Wow. Not worn out. I like the distress. Worn looking. Wash. Yes. You just kind of see right there around. That's soft. Pre-wash. It is soft. That is Flag and Anthem. Okay. Flag and Anthem. Chatham Burnout Slub Henley. You love a Henley. Mm -hmm. Olive color, size large, $39.50. Wow. Kind of similar to what I got on. Except long sleeve. Except long sleeve. And you don't have it in long sleeve. Lighter. Yeah. That is a keeper, I have a feeling, if, like if he it. likes the fit. And look. Look, looky there. Yeah. The colors together. Yeah. That looks good. That does look good. All right. I'm liking it. I think you. How did he get such a good stylist so daggum fast? It's taken me months. <laughs> I'm easy to get to know. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I am okay. pretty I am pretty predictable. Not always. <laughs> well, apparently somebody's been able to predict me here. <laughs> oh, a camo sweater. You don't have any camo sweaters, do you? No. I have a t-shirt, but I love this. Okay. Is this the stitches and stripes? Yes. Yeah. Almost like a sweatshirt material, but yet it's not. Stitches and stripes, Winona Scoop Neck, Scoop Neck COT. Cotton blend sweater. Size large, olive for 68. Yeah, I like, I like. The is colors that, I think I like. Is that your color? I don't know, what do you think? Mm, I'm not sure about that one. Well, most people say greens look pretty good on me, so. Yeah, but that's kind of a muted green. I'm going to say maybe a brighter green. I we'll don't see. Know. We'll see. I'm sure the viewers will let you know what they like. Well, I'm sure you like. will too whenever um, I try it on. Well, I can't see you. You disappear when you put that up to you. <laughs> you know, it's a, I, I couldn't see you. Yeah. And it is 60 cotton and 40 viscose. Okay. We, we went through this before about the viscose. So I forget. I believe viscose is a form of rayon. Okay. I believe. I Tell believe. me if I'm wrong down below. All right. I'm excited. You're next. All right. I like this color. Mm -hmm. I like this color. And it looks like, ooh, that's a hoodie. Oh, that must be the hoodie she was talking that about. That is included. a hoodie. That is, hang on. Hawker Rye? Hawker Rye. Now, what kind of jeans did I get? Hawker Rye. Hawker Rye. Mm -hmm. I like the jeans. You like their brand. Oh, that's nice. Space dye. Or space. I have a, a hoodie to go with my jeans now. Mm -hmm. Space dye hoodie. And it has a kangaroo pocket. Kangaroo pocket. She loves it whenever I take and wear a hoodie like this and I put my cell phone in there. I hate that. And it pulls the pocket down. He's got this she said rectangle. It's so attractive when I do this that. rectangle that just hangs down. It's so gaudy looking. Hawker Rye Space Dye Popover Hoodie. Look at there. I know. It goes. To, it goes. It goes. Burgundy color, size large for only $49. You got I an really, excellent I box. really like those. This is my favorite so yeah. far, but I like the others that go I with it. I do too. I do too. I can layer and be warm this, this winter. This might be his first five out of five. I think this is my favorite box so far that I've got. Last one you like too, though. I think you have the, a lot I of... think I like this one better than my last one. All right. Okay. Next is from Market and Spruce. Ooh, I think I like this. 
That is soft. It is so soft. Look at the colors and it's a button Henley. It doesn't go all the way down. Does that look good with me? Yeah. So that's soft. I could actually, I would actually wouldn't mind wearing gonna, that myself. You gotta, are we going to share this one? Yeah, I wouldn't mind wearing that myself because that, that is soft. That'd be, ooh. We've shared clothes before, y'all. That feels good on the... It is I refuse soft. to take and share her dresses. Hoodies, That's not true. Hoodies, That's I'm going to say true. we've shared. I have a picture where he got into my dress. Yeah. As a joke. Yeah. <laughs> it a was joke. a Halloween dress. <laughs> yeah, that was funny. Yep. But I love that material. I What's do that too. made out of? It feels, I don't know. I didn't even get to talk about it. Dwayne's Sorry. just taken over. It's really pretty. That's all I'll say, I guess. <laughs> okay, what is the material? Let's get to it. Ooh, it feels weird on the inside, silky like. And you got an extra button there. 78 rayon, 18 polyester, and four spandex. So Ooh. almost kind of like a brushed knit. I'll have to see if I get too hot, but that is really pretty. I never really noticed polyester feeling that soft. The, when they mix it with certain things, it does get very soft. Oh. I think this is kind of like a brush knit. It is. Is this Market and Spruce? Yep. Market and Spruce Joey Henley Cozy Brushed brush Knit Top. Burnt orange color size large for 44 That's a good one. I like that one. You put that on, I'll be wanting to rub on you all the time because you, that's soft. So you don't always want to rub on me then? I would more so with that <laughs> if you wore that more so. Next. Next. All right. What should I try? All right. Let's look at the, the chinos. Jeans. They're oh. not jeans. Ooh, what is that? They're not? That feels weird. <laughs> what is that? It's like a golf, like Made a. Made flex golf. But you know what that would be good for? Playing golf. Because <laughs> it says Made flex golf. Yes, but also... And it does have some give to it. It would also be good for walking in because it's more like an active wear. Really? But looks nicer and dressier than like sweats. They're really soft. What's the brand on those? I don't know. I'm checking them out. Flag and Anthem. Flag and Anthem. Flag and Anthem oh, anywhere. That's, that's got pockets... Kind of like a poly type that probably won't wear out. Like, no, it's like an active. It's like a casual, dressier, a dressy casual, mm -hmm. active to wear. It says right here, flag and anthem anywhere. Five pocket pants anywhere, meaning you can wear them anyhow. Uh, Nashville straight, so it's a straight leg khaki, mm -hmm. thirty two thirty. For sixty nine fifty. So would these be somewhat kind of a dressy? It could be dressy. Casual. Yeah, it could. But it could also be. But it's so flexible that you could even go walking or golfing, or something like that. I don't have anything like this. Uh uh. It can actually be lots of different. I wonder if they're warm. Right. I I don't know. What are they made out of? Something. Hundred percent poly. Mm -hmm. So that this winter would probably mm -hmm. stop the wind from blowing mm -hmm. through them too. I'm excited to see all day. What's this tag say over here? All day performance. Motion stretch that offers comfort, retention, and durability for your versatile lifestyle. Built-in stretch. Moisture wicking, all day comfort, UPF protection. It's got sunblock built into it. Really? Yeah. I'm, think, cool. I'm thinking that this in the summertime might be hot. Wintertime, they might be great. I don't know. Well, fall mm. is a little chillier, and this yeah. is like a fall color. I'm a little curious. I'm not so. I'm not a hundred percent sure about these, but we'll see. If they're comfortable, he'll like them. Yeah. I thought it was very well. Okay, my last item has some sherry sparkle oh, to it. Oh, you like the glitter. Uh, well, it's not glitter. This is well, like Lurex threads, which are in copper and silver and gorgeousness. Lurex <gasps> threads, so that you mean shiny threads? It's metallic threading. That's what oh. Lurex is. OMG. 
It has peacock blue in it. Why don't you? This is party. This is P-U-R-D-Y, party. Not real soft. No, it's. Maybe it's, go it's, close it's to make blouse. them see the threads. It's a blouse. It's, yeah. And it's lined. It's fully lined. It has a ruffled uh, neck with a split. <laughs> it has a ruffled collar with a split neck. You're dangerous. No, I'm not. Well, that's why has I some like to st stand back. This is beautiful. I like this. Do you? I don't know. He it's going to be like an it. awful lot of beauty there. <laughs> okay, so this is the... Is this Daniel Rain? Daniel Rain, Pabla textured blouse, navy. They're calling that navy. I thought it was peacock blue. Maybe it is navy. No. Size large for 68. His is always 68. It's just 68 over the board, pretty much. Um, yeah, I'm excited to try that on. I like anything with a little sparkle. It's got a lot of buttons. It makes me happy. It's 97 polyester, 3% other fibers, which would be the Lurex threading. And then the... Lining is 100% polyester. All right, so that's it for my box. Let's get I have your one last more. one. Yeah. All right. What is this? This is a sweater, it looks like. It is a ooh, oh. sweater hoodie. A button up. If you're going to get a sweater, sweater, a Henley and a hoodie is the way to go for you. Yep. That feels nice. It does feel nice. I've never had a sweater hoodie. What about those ones you got at Bass Pro? They're sweaters, they're not hoodies. But they have buttons, but just no hoodies. They have hooded. buttons. Oh, oh, and it's got hoodie strings too. Commerce. Oh, it does have, yes, it does have strings. I don't see a commerce on here. Um, it says commerce. Corinth. Hooded Henley. Oh, it's calling it Retrofit brand. Corinth hooded, hooded Henley sweater, dark green, size large for only $48 for a sweater. It has a kangaroo pocket too. Yes, it has my, oh, it has my, my phone gosh. pocket. <laughs> he is tickled. Can't you tell? I think he likes this box more than he likes snacks. Don't push it. <laughs> You're pushing it. All right, so let's go over the totals real quick before we do the try on. So let's start with, y'all, this is Dwayne's fix number four, four. And he has secured, hopefully, a stylist that knocks it out of the park for his style. Four. <laughs> so his total of his box is $250 for everything. The buy all, 25% off discount is $62.50. Making his subtotal $187 minus the $20 styling fee and minus the $20 styling fee, his order total is $167.50 for all five. That includes a pair of chinos that are like fancy pants. Um, Ooh, I'm gonna have flex fancy pants. technology, a sweater, a flannel, hoodies. I mean there's no way I can beat that. That that was cheap. Like I said, the only item that I really kind of questioning, can you guess what it is? The pants. The pants. I'm not real sure about the pants. It's, it's a weird material for me. But if it's comfortable. Yeah. All right. The total of my box is $327 minus the 25% off if I kept all five would be $81.75, which brings my total down to $245.25 for five pieces. That's not too bad. There, there are a couple of blouses that are pretty pricey in my box. A lot pricier than his box. So Do you have a styling fee? No, I have the style pass. You have a styling fee. How come I don't get a style because pass? Because you haven't been a, a subscriber for that long. How long do I got to subscribe? For? I don't know their rules. I don't know. So you don't get $20 off? Because mm -mm. you're not charged at the beginning with? Right. Oh. But once you've been, you have a good stylist. So yes, I do. Once you are in for a certain amount of time, I'm sure she'll hook you up with the style pass when she can. Well, she did an awesome job of picking stuff out. 
You're not gonna lose your $20, that's for sure. Uh, there's something in there that I'm for sure gonna keep, I'm sure. I have a feeling he might keep all. I might. I don't know. It depends on those pants. But the first shirt? Yeah. The flannel? Mm -hmm. I love it. <laughs> but you also really love the other hoodies too. Mm -hmm. I do. And he hasn't cleaned out his closet yet. He sees all these clothes in his closet, but a lot of them are way too big for him. He needs to clean them out and then replace them with stuff that would fit because he has lost a lot of weight. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. All right, we will be back with the try on. Stay tuned. I have the first top on. Um, it is very sheer, but I don't think you can really tell that. No, you really can't. Um, I'm not really jazzed. It's okay. Um, it's not anything that I <laughs> feel like I really need. Maybe you can see through it a little bit. Uh, I'm gonna pass on this one. Uh, it does have the balloon sleeves. I have very short arms, so it, it covers half of my arm. And the, the ruffle in the center, I'm not super cracked up on. What are you doing? I wanna see something. Now let your sleeve down. Is that the way it's supposed to go like that maybe? I don't know, but I'm not gonna. Yeah, I know, I just have shorts on. It was 80s today. Um, no, this is a no for me. Your turn. I he has two items. Yeah, you're up. Okay. I got my hoodie on. Hoodie sweater. Hoodie sweater. And I like it. I do like it. The only issue that I'm seeing with this one is if I put my phone in my kangaroo pouch, it's going to be down to my knees. <laughs> and I've told you the top button usually stays yes, Mom. unbuttoned. I like it, but it is too long on him. Yeah, it's pretty long. And I know it's just when I put it, if I put any weight in the front pockets, it's going to, whatever I put in there, it's going to be down to my knees. It always is. He always does that. This right here, <laughs> it stretches even more. Yeah. I, I liked it, I though. Lo I, if it wasn't, I love the feel yeah, of it. Yeah. I love the color of it. Yeah. Yeah. That's going to be a And enough. I think she did a good job picking that she out. Did. She did a wonderful yeah. job picking that if out. If it was just up to here, yeah, it would be better. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What about the pants? The pants? They're silky feeling. They're weird. <laughs> They feel weird. I'm not used to I'm not used to something like this. Tell us what you really think. I can tell you what I really think. They fit nice. Can you see? Yeah, they do fit nice. Yeah. They fit nice and they don't feel bad. Are they stretchy? Just, they yeah, they're they are pretty fairly stretchy, yeah. I just don't know if I can get used to this material. Can you Squat pretty easily in them. Do you feel the give? Yeah, I've got room. I'm gonna say they do give, and they are they are nice. They are nice. Yeah. They are polyester, and they feel nice. They do feel nice. But I hear a but. I, I'm a little I'm a little nervous about like I don't think I could wear these in the summertime. I'm afraid the polyester would be very hot. I've had polyester shirts. And I don't do well with them in the summertime. But in the well, summer, you're going to be wearing shorts, right? Well, I know, but like a warm day, I'm afraid these might be too hot. Well, I think that's why they're a dark color, because they're meant to be fall or winter, not summer. I like, I like clothes that I can, or pants like that, that I can wear multiple seasons. Okay, well. But, you know, they are nice. They're, they are very nice shoes. I have all tops, um, so I have four more to try on, and he has three, so. I, I am thinking about passing on these two, okay. but there are some items that I do like coming up. Okay, we'll be right. We're here. <laughs> okay, I like the design of the sweater. It's very soft, and it's really comfortable. Like, it's got lots of give to it. If it was a different color, I would probably keep it. But with this color being the predominant up top, I, I just kind of think that it washes me out. But other than that, it's a really nice sweater. 
So if the cream color is not bad with your skin complexion, I highly recommend it. It's really soft it and really actually, cozy. It actually looks really nice. It doesn't look bad on you. Well, except for the washing me out. Otherwise, it's a nice sweater. Decent quality. Yeah. Feels like, feels like. Feels like a really good quality. I'm really loving this shirt. I like the color of it. I like the way it feels. It really the looks good, nice. The hoodie? Yeah. And you know what? It looks nice with those funny pants. <laughs> with the funny pants? Well, that's what he said. Funny pants. Yeah, it does look nice. It together. looks really nice as an outfit. And this pocket, I could put my phone in and this one wouldn't. It's wouldn't still going to sag. No, it, sag maybe, but not uh -huh. to my knees. Well, maybe not to your knees, but I guarantee you all, every time he puts his phone in his hoodie pockets, it's like this big rectangle everywhere he goes. It's just really... So what am I allowed to put in my pocket? Your hands. My hands? <laughs> That's what back pockets are for, for the phone. <laughs> I never I never put my phone in my back pocket. Maybe you should start. I'm afraid I would break the screen on my phone. I like it. I like it too. I like the color of it. I like the way it feels. I like the hoodie. I got room. Kind of, it's, it hangs back there, but it's not too bulky. I like that. So is that a keeper or is that a maybe? That's a maybe. Maybe. I'm going to say it's a maybe. <laughs> All right. We got a couple more. Or I have, what? I have, I have three more. He has two more, right? Two. 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 Oh, excuse me. I didn't see you. <laughs> Green and green. Green and green. Okay, I'll start, I guess. Um, I have the camo sweater on. <clears throat> it feels a little tight in the arms. Um, I love the idea of a camo sweater. I really do. This isn't it, though. I mean, it's just, I don't know. There's just something about the fit that is off. Um, could be those extra few pounds I put on lately. We won't talk about that. They're not staying. <laughs> uh, I don't know. I just think the fabrication, something, something's just not feeling right. What do you think? I don't know. I can't see you. Oh. Um, it doesn't look bad. It's just not wowing me with the fit. Okay. I like that. I like this too. Yeah, that looks I love, nice. I love the um, washed look. I guess how, is that what it, is that what it would be? Washed look. Mm -hmm. Is that the way you describe it? Pre-washed. You know, say I love it. Yeah. I like I like the color. I, I like too. I like the fit. Fits good. Fits good. Color's good. I like that, that you left is, a couple buttons undone. That's nice. This is kind of my style that I that I like. Mm -hmm. The distressed kind of the, cowboy style. Yeah, the vintage look. Vintage, kind of. yeah. The distressed vintage look. Yeah. Kind of worn. Yeah. Worn in. Yeah. Uh, br broke in. I like the broke in, broke in. look. Yeah. <laughs> Not the broke down, the broke in. So is this a keeper or is this a maybe? I'm thinking this may be a keeper. Oh, he said the K word. You don't hear that very often, y'all. It's very soft, very comfortable. Good. Well, I have two more to try on. He has one, and I saved the best two possibilities for me for the end. So we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. All right. All right. Go over this way. Okay. So he has his last one on, and I have my fourth. You have that soft, <laughs> that really soft feel on. I love it. <laughs> Hey, we don't look half bad, I don't think. We're, we're styling now. <laughs> Long sleeve brush knit top with shorts. Styling. Okay, y'all. It's soft. It's really soft. The color is pretty. I like the color. Um, I thought it might be a little long, but maybe not too bad. I'm The only thing I'm concerned with is it pilling because it is a brushed knit. Um, the colors are really really pretty I don't know should I gamble the brush knit and hope it doesn't pill it feels really hot really are, hot are there any reviews out there on those no oh. 
It feels very, very warm and usually brush knit does. But this is obviously going to be a shirt for the winter, you know, not when it's hot. So I don't know. I'm on the fence. This one I'm on the fence about. I don't know. What do you think? I kind of like it. Kind of? I, I love the feel of it. What about the look and stuff? I like I kind of like the looks of it. I think it looks nice. He kind of likes it. That doesn't really Well, you me. know that's what you're going to get out of me. You know I'm not going to take any. Rate the shirt 1 to 10. Truthful. Truthful. I'm saying about eight and a half. Oh, I thought for sure he was going to go for a seven. <laughs> well, I'm about an eight and a half. Okay. I'll think on it. You're up. I'm up. <laughs> this is the shirt that I, lo I love. I can say I, lo I love this one. This is my favorite. You like this better than the last green shirt you had on? Yeah. I do, but... <laughs> or but, do you like... Yeah. <laughs> I... I think it goes with the green shirt very yeah. well to where like, hey, <laughs> I, I like, the, like them together too. How are you doing? I'm doing fine. How are you? <laughs> I, I like it. See, now I thought this was gray, but maybe this is green. I think it's... It's kind of hard to tell. It, it goes together, I think, pretty well. Yeah. But yes, I, I, I like the, these two together. Uh-huh. Yeah, they're nice. Yeah, the, these are probably my two favorite right here. Well, he didn't have a five out of five, even though we thought he would. But he does like two, so that's really good for Scooby. Mm -hmm. the, the pants, I'm just, I don't dislike them. I, I, don't, I don't dislike any of it, really. I, Other than the sweater. The sweater, it's too long. I gotta say, it, it's got so much stretch to it. it. It's long. If it was a little shorter, it would probably work better for me. But it's got so much stretch. By the time I would take and put anything in the pockets, if I did, that it would be down on my knees. <laughs> okay, he's done. I have one more. I'll be right back. All right, I saved the Daniel Rain to the end. Um, I don't know. I love the metallic. I love the greenish bluish tint. They're saying navy. I say it's more like peacock blue. Um, there is not a definite winner in this box. I, I look at it in the screen here and all I see is a bunch of white. I don't know. Let me turn it down just a little bit. Whoops. I don't know. What do you guys think? Back up a little bit. I'm not sure. Well, I think it looks nice. I think it does look nice. I like the ruffle collar. I like the split V here. I like the little buttons and the pleating. I love, love the metallic. I think I would love it more if it was just this, this gold and this peacock and not all this white. I think the white is throwing me off. Um, Where do you see white? Isn't that what these flowers are? No, white? No, that's not a white. It looks white. What do you call it? Oh, it's kind of like a little bit of a purple look almost in some of it. Purple? Yeah, kind of. That's not purple. A violet. You think? A little bit of a violet look, yes. It's not white. It looks white to me. Try and find something white to compare it to. <laughs> He's on a mission. I'm on a mission. Okay, here's a piece of foam that we have here. See the difference in white? Yeah. That is not white. That is kind of a violet. Oh. Well, there's a lot of it, whatever it is. But this is white right here. Well, is it cream? Or do you think no, it is it's purple? No, it's not cream. It's more of a purple. Really? Yeah, it depends on where you look. Right in this area, it looks kind of uh, violet. Up here, it looks kind of a pink, kind of a pink hue. 
where there's kind of like two layers oh together. okay see and then it changes it, does look it changes pink. right here at this the arm looks ceiling. pink huh. i don't know tell me y'all is it a keeper or is it like too loud too busy i just i don't know this one i really don't know but yeah the metallic threading is great i love metallic threading and if you like it, what color pants would you wear other than jeans? If you wore dress pants, what color pants would you wear with this? Brown? I don't know if I can find that color gold. I don't know. Leather. Leather. <laughs> no. I don't know, y'all. I'm going to need your help on this box. I didn't have a heavy hitter winner in this box for myself. Um... I'm, I'm, I'm leaning towards no on the brush knit. It was just really hot. I love the colors. I love the soft. I just don't, I don't think it's wow enough for my closet. I'm really trying to look at all buying different. Dwayne and I are really considering like major decluttering and, you know, maybe getting rid of 70% of our possessions just because we're kind of a prisoner to our clutter. So um, it really kind of makes you halt and think before you just buy. And I'm not sure that this is what I would consider like something when I look in my closet, oh, I love that so much kind of feeling, you know? So his, however, he has two really strong. I'm thinking these two here are, you know, a, a keeper's. They look really nice on him. Yeah. You can wear them alone or together. The other kind of maroon hoodie or whatever. Oh, yeah, is. that was nice. I'm thinking about it. Wow. The pants, just because I'm unsure about them, I don't think I'm going to keep those. And the knee length sweater <laughs> hoodie, <laughs> I don't say, I'll probably send it back. Well, so if but you really, I, I, but I do love the color of it and yeah, that, you know, yeah. the material and stuff I like, it's just that length that's, mm -hmm. I don't think it's going to work great for me. Well, keeping two or three items, you won't get a, you won't get a discount. Mm -hmm. Um, you have to keep all five for a discount, but there's no way he can keep all five, not with the fit issue in that sweater. So yeah. It'll be two or three. You'll have to you'll have to stay tuned, and maybe we'll do a uh, what we kept this month video together, if we can find the time. <laughs> so I guess that's it. Um, yeah, I'd say Bailey, you did a pretty good job. Good job. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Well, I, I do approve. Well, as. Leslie stays with me for a while. She'll kind of get to know. And right now, I'm, I'm kind of really picky. I really am. I'm trying to not just buy what I like because I want to just buy what I love, love, love. And that has me kind of looking at things differently. I'm pretty finicky about mine, too. That's mm -hmm. kind of the reason for the pants. Probably not going to keep those. But that's what's shocking. Stitch, or uh, fix number four... And he's in love with his boxes. You know, it's like, wow, because he is picky. So, yeah. All right. Yeah. Well, y'all, we're going to let you go. Um, until we meet again, Godspeed and many, many blessings. Yep. Thanks for putting up with us. <laughs> Bye, guys. Bye, y'all. <laughs>